Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to the world of AI. In today's video, we're going to be discussing AI Legion, which is a new project and is currently ranked number four on GitHub. And basically, this is a new application in which it is a versatile tool that can be used for a wide variety of applications. And basically, it's an LLM powered autonomous agent platform. So before we actually get into this video, guys, please subscribe, please like, and please comment down whatever you want to see in the future. I have a lot of different videos, so I highly recommend that you go check them out. There's a lot of content and free value that will definitely benefit you guys. So please do that. And if you want to donate and support the channel, there's a link down in the description below to do so. But with that thought, let's get right into the video. So what is AI Legion? Well, as I said, it's a platform that is versatile that has a versatile tool in which it can be used for a wide variety of applications including automation natural language processing and machine learning it provides a framework for creating autonomous agents that can work and together to accomplish complex tasks which is actually amazing one potential application of the ai legion platform is its field of customer service now i've actually outlined a lot of different autonomous applications but the thing that stood out to me is that this is actually very new and it actually just got a lot of popularity very recently. And one thing I really liked is how they focus on the field of customer service in the sense that it's able to direct as well as give prompts that interact very well with in that case of customer service. Now the platform can be used to develop intelligent chat boxes, which is amazing and could be outsourced to a lot of businesses could be used for B2B clients or B2C clients. Now, this can also assist in customers with their inquiries and provide helpful, helpful responses. The, the use of LLM technology allows the chat boxes actually to understand nat natural languages and generate human-like responses, making the interaction more natural and intuitive for the users. And what we're going to be doing today is not actually installing it. I won't be showing you how to install it, but I'll give you a better understanding of how you can actually do it. Now, another potential for this application that I really like of the platform is that it's data analysis. If you are able to get a chance to check this out on the GitHub, definitely read through some of the readme files as well as the instructions because you'll get a better understanding of how to actually operate it as well as get a better analysis on the actual application. Now, the platform could be also used in decision making scenarios where the agent works together to weigh different options and provide recommendations based on their analysis. For example, if, if you had in a business context, the agents could analyze market trends and provide insights on the best course of actions for a company to take ta tasks to actually reach that objective. One thing that I wanted to mention, like other LLMs and fully autonomous applications like Baby AGI and AutoGPT, one thing that AI Legion is able to perform is that the ability to learn from its mistakes. And that's what makes autonomous AI applications work in a different way compared to other applications. In this case, the agents may make mistakes initially, but they're able to learn and operate themselves across the objective as well as the goals that they have but they can recover and improve their performance over time, which is a great note to put out. This means that the platform can actually have potential to become more intelligent over time and effective as it is used more frequently with more people using it, as well as when the data sets acquire more data from different people using the application. And that's basically the gist of what the application is, guys. This is something that you should highly recommend like checking out because it's fairly new. So it's not out there as much at the moment, but there's a lot of information right now on the LLM. And right now there's a huge influx of autonomous AI applications in the recent weeks. And it just goes to show that there's different applications and an innovation in the AI world where there's tech like this being released on a day-to-day -day basis now. And it's good to see different platforms that are working on different like basic industries as well as different focuses like in this case ai legion is focusing on the customer aspect base and by releasing a chat box that helps autonomously figure out objectives so it, it's just it's very good to see like different llms powered like agents that are being released on different platforms now i'm going to go on to the next step in which we're going to be showing you guys how to actually install it 
So first things first, you need to make sure that you have Node installed. It's said in the description that you will need Node 10, at least Node 10. So make sure you have it installed for your processor. If it's a Windows or Mac, make sure you install it on this website and I'll leave the link down in the description below. Now, another thing that you will need is a custom search API from Google Cloud and you can do this for free. It's completely free. You can set up your own uh, project and you can get the key that you'll be placing later on in your actual end, end file on the actual platform. Now, the AI Legion project is actually written with TypeScript which is a statistical typed programming language that is a superset of JavaScript, which is why we're going to be using a node. And it currently has 486 stars on GitHub, which is pretty good. And it's been kind of like getting a lot of popularity right now. So you won't be seeing a lot of videos or a lot of installation info on this. So I just wanted to highlight something cool like this as it's fairly new and it's something that could get a lot of popularity in the future. Now to use the actual application, you need to have Node 10, which I said, and a higher version installed and set up the secrets in the .n file. If you want me to make a more detailed version, I could definitely do that. But basically you're gonna need an open, open or Google API key and you're gonna need the Google search engine ID, which you can get from this link over here. And I'll leave that in the description below. And you can run this with a editor, a code editor. It could be your local prompt machine or you could also use visual studio code visual studio code is much more easier to use and it's more appealing so i definitely recommend that you use it it's completely free to download and make sure that you're able to have python installed obviously as you'll need it to configure some of the files now the secrets in include the open ai api key when you're working with the actual .n file and google custom search engine api keys this will allow the agent to actually search on the web so this is why you will actually require these API keys. Now, once the secrets are set up on the .n file, you're going to be able to program and start using the command npm run start, which is over here. You just need to basically install npm and then you need to follow by running the program with this code over here. And basically, if you have ChatGPT4, you can run it with ChatGPT4, but if you if you don't have the paid version, you can also just use GPT 3.5, which is completely free for anyone. And the user can interact with the agents through this console. So the file will also create a memory folder, which will add new memories from the data collection. Now, it is important to note that the agent may mistake initially as they learn to operate themselves, but they'll generally learn from their mistakes and recover different memories and data sets, which will be inputted in this folder. Now, each agent stores its state under the dot store folder. So it might not actually go into the memories folder. It might go into the dot store folder directory, which allows for a selective wiping of states between runs and effective replays of moments of for debugging. And obviously you can use this to clear data. Now that basically summarizes today's video on age AI Legion guys. I hope you found this video interesting. Now, AI Legion project has a lot of potential basically with this application in fields such as automation and natural long language processing, as well as machine learning. Now it can be used commercially and could develop autonomous agents that could work together to accomplish different types of tasks, such as customer service, which is something that they're trying to focus on, data analysis, as well as basic decision-making in, in the business environment, as well as in a commercial environment. Now, overall, this project has a lot of different potential and is continuously going to be worked upon. So I definitely recommend that you try playing around with it because certain things like this can be very helpful for you in your day-to-day -day task. And it might basically give you a, type, a new type of like want or need that could basically be beneficial for your objectives. Now, that's just a summary of AI Legion, guys. I hope you found this video very interesting. If you want to subscribe, please do so and turn on the notification bell. I try to upload a little bit of around two videos approximately a day, which gives you a lot of input and value on things that would benefit you in your day-to-day -day base, basis on whatever you might do if it's relating to your work or your own leisure. But that's basically today's video, guys. I hope you found this interesting, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out, fellas.